Hello, everyone. Welcome to the course of uh, microwave and optical communications. In today's class, we are going to learn about light sources. So what are these light sources? It's a component or a device through which you are getting some sort of light or that particular component or device is emitting some sort of light that can be considered as the light sources. Okay. So these light sources mainly are of two types. One is LED, another one is laser. Okay. So you can also consider it as laser, which is made of semiconductor materials. Okay. So LED can be considered as an incoherent light where frequency and the waveform are not identical. Whereas coming to the laser, it can be considered as the coherent light where the frequency and the waveform are identical. See, so what happens in an LED means as the current increases, the optical power in the LED also increases, which is very much linear. Okay. Whereas coming to the semiconductor laser, this particular laser exhibits a curve output with respect to current as well as power, which is somewhat non-linear. Okay. So what happens through the laser means as the current increases, the power also increases, but after a threshold point, even though the current increase or as the current is getting increased, it exhibits a sharp output. Okay. Irrespective of the current, it exhibits a very sharp output, which is nothing but the uh, sharp wavelength or the uh, directional uh, light which you generally observe in the lasers okay so the main advantage of laser over an led is it will be having a high power output with less current okay so irrespective of the current as i have already said it will be uh, dissipating a sharp or exhibits a sharp output in the form of light okay so let's see the graphical uh, way how an LED reacts as well as a laser reacts. See, this is a simple uh, graph with respect to current as well as power. Okay. So this is a current power characteristics of the light source comparison. If you see over here, this X axis is with respect to current and the Y axis is with respect to power. Okay. So if you see the LED characteristics as the current is increasing, the power with respect to the LED also increases linearly, which is nothing but linearly almost in a straight path. Okay. But coming to the laser, laser, okay coming to the laser as the current increases as the current increases the power also increases but after a threshold point even though the current increases it produces a vast high output which is keep on increasing irrespective of the current this laser will exhibit a high power okay so this is how which is non-linear okay this is how the linearity or the non-linearity of with respect to led and laser differs okay so these are the basic points regarding the light sources which is with respect to led as well as a laser okay